Oh, we got abducted. <laughs> I love that sound, though. Oh, and here we get the awesome music again. Oh, man. At long last, the time has come to light Venus Lighthouse's beacon. With the second beacon lit, only two will remain. No, lighting Jupiter is virtually the same as lighting Mars. That is true. Jupiter is really all that remains. That's right. Your dreams are within your grasp now. <laughs> oh man, I haven't heard that voice in a while. <laughs> Why are you still here, Felix? I thought I ordered you on ahead to the ship. I've already sent Jenna and the others to the dock at Itajima. Itajima? Hmm. Familiar sounding name? No. We don't even know what it, where Itajima is. Then why did you come back? Because I have a different promise to keep. A promise, you say? Ah, you must mean Sheba. Anger. Yes. Shiba, why haven't you released her yet? You promised to free her once you got into Venus Lighthouse. And that's what brought you back here? Ha! Well, I'm afraid, Felix, you're a little too... You're a little too... Untrustworthy to give her to. You promised not to involve anyone who wasn't related to this matter. Ah, but you see, she is related. There, uh, there we go. I thought uh, Minardi was going to say it, actually. She was special. Of course. Skepticism. <laughs> because Sheba is a special adept. You guys learned something from the first two lighthouses. And what would that be? In order to enter each lighthouse, you needed an adept of that clan. Ah, so that now we get at the heart of the matter. Right now, we have fire, earth, and water adepts, but no wind adept. <laughs> that, that, that does seem to be the case. Do we need Shiva to get into the Jupiter Lighthouse? I'm sorry, Felix, but we can't even enter without a wind adept. That being the case, I guess I understand why you can't Shiva can't set Shiva free. Oh, we can't even enter the lighthouse without a wind adapt. There we go. It, that line always, I don't know, just for some reason the way it's written, it always seems to me, strikes me as odd. It seems you, that you too have learned something. If that is all, then you should go, Felix. No, I cannot leave Shiva behind. Hmm. Do I smell the do I sell, smell the smelly smell of traitorism? Traitorism? Treachery? <laughs> I'm taking Shiba to the ship. Now. <laughs> what are you talking about, Felix? We don't know what will happen when you light this beacon. I won't leave Shiba here to find out. We told you we'd protect Shiba. Don't you trust us? We protected you from dying in the river all those years ago. That, that, that's not what I'm saying. Awkward silence. It's just best to be safe. Don't tell us what's best, Felix. You're not taking Sheba. Why not? What? You don't trust me? How can we after you just demanded we free Sheba? That was the voice of Minardi. If we had trusted you a moment ago, Sheba would be free now. But, but, I did not understand. Now, come with me, Sheba. I shall protect you. <laughs> Are you ready to do this, even though it means fighting us? I believe he is. He would not have defied us if he will lacked the will to fight. If it means protecting Sheba from harm, then I must. Ah, you'll go down like a two-year-old boy. You've seen what we can do. You know you can't stop us. 
how can you protect Shiba when you can't even protect yourself? <laughs> this rebellious attitude is exactly why we've never let you fight. Haven't you been given enough reason to fear us in these travels? Oh wow, you guys are you guys are worse than I thought. But you're smart. You're no fighter, Felix. How can you hope to stand against us? You've questioned us for the last time. Let's see what you can do. Oh no! Looks like they're having falling out over Shiba. Yeah, maybe. There's something. I can speak. Well, there's something more to it, though. It seems the Taurus and Minardi no longer trust Felix. Looks like the perfect opportunity to just fall into our laps. I mean, yeah. Yeah, let's yeah, let's go let's go prevent them from lighting the beacon. Come on, I mean they're not even expecting us. We could like probably just sneak up behind them and just like kick them in the mag of the head. They wouldn't even know what hit them and come on, let's sneak. Oh. Quick, let's save just in case things go terribly. <laughs> but come on, let's just sneak up. Sneak up. And they'll never see it coming. Watch. Isaac. God damn it, Felix! God damn! We were sneaking up behind him! <laughs> so, you've come to stop us. Look what your defiance has, defiance has brought us, Felix. I don't need you or anyone to rescue me, Isaac. I was just about to settle things with Satoros and Minardi. You can watch. Ha, 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 ha. And then we'll show you the true power of this beacon's light. I'd like to see you try, Felix. But Shiba has nothing to do with this, so set Shiba free. Silence. You'd best tread lightly, Felix, or both you and Shiba will suffer. If anything happens to Shiba, we will have, we will have failed Faran. We won't permit you to lay a hand on Shiba or Felix. <laughs> so you're worried about Sheba too? Hmm. Don't worry, we won't hurt Sheba if you meet our conditions. Conditions? What, are, what kind of conditions are we talking about? What are you doing, Satoros? Leave this to me. Hmm. You're a bit, uh... You're getting a bit, um... Slimy, aren't you, Satoros? Shiba, do you remember the rod connected to Hesperia? The... Oh wait, we have we not even heard Shiba speak this entire game? Because I think she just went dot 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 back when we were in, um... Was it Bobby? No, Tolby. The... The rod of Hesperia? The rod required to reach the Jupiter Lighthouse! Yes. Those who pursue us bear a rod. Is it the one? Sheba, stay where you are. You can do it from there. <laughs> oh man, she's 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 sigh mentally mentalisting frantically. How about it, Sheba? Uh, well, Sheba. Perhaps. Perhaps. Perhaps what? Don't yell at her. We were not yelling! We just want a straight answer. <laughs> I love that. Not yelling as I yell at you that we're not yelling. So, Sheba. Th their minds are veiled. I, I can't see clearly, but I, I, I think it's the one. I'll have to do for a voice, I don't know. It's a waste to make her try again. So what do we do? Do you know the terms we will require before we agree not to harm Sheba? Yep. You're smarter than I thought if you've already figured it out. Well, I know exactly what you're gonna say. Yep, if you give us the Shaman's Rod, Sheba will not be harmed, agreed? Um... Honestly, yeah. 
no 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 material possession is more, more worth more than her life the shaman's rod if it means saving Sheba I will give it to you what but Hammond gave that to you Ivan yeah it's a it doesn't matter don't you care what happens to Sheba then you will give us the rod oh I'll give you the rod all right no <laughs> not even gonna go there well done Satoros we finally have the shaman's rod Ah, but you know what? I still have the Mars Star. Go get it, Felix. Why, why me? To ensure your loyalty to us. Exactly, I would do the same thing. Anger and frustration. Go on, Felix. I live this. And well, we're gonna give him the hand. We're gonna give him the shaman's rod, even though it wasn't in our inventory, but. <laughs> What should I do with the rod? I've got something. I've got an idea of what you can do with that rod, Felix. Where do you think you're going, Sheba? Wait. We we gave you the rod. Now release Sheba. Ah. Ha ha ha. Whatever do you mean? You said we'd you'd free Sheba if we gave you the rod. The, those were you. Those were your term. Those were your ter terms. I can't even speak anymore. God. We gave you the rod. Now release Sheba. Ha! Huh. You seem to have misunderstood. I said we wouldn't harm Sheba. He did say he wouldn't harm Sheba. Never said he'd release him. You're altering the bargain. No, no. Those were his words. Ha! <laughs> We can't help it if you misinterpreted Satoros' terms. Um, yes, we made a deal. Sorry, Garrett. Besides, if we were to release Sheba, she'd be in quite a fix. Quite a fix? What, f what, what do you mean? Sheba can't get back to Lalavero alone. What, what do you mean? We're going to take Sheba... Oh, no. Ha <laughs> ha! That's right. You won't be going back. This is it for you, in true supervillain form. Excuse me, but you think you can take us that easily? Uh, yeah, exactly. You're not the one from going anywhere. <laughs> in true hero form. <laughs> Bring it on, whelp. You won't live long enough to regret your stupidity. Oh man, I... Satoris is so cool in this scene. I forgot about that. Prepare to experience the first. <laughs> Prepare to experience firsthand the horror of a master fire adept. Prepare for trouble and make it double. <laughs> well, this is it, guys. Final boss time. We started out with a fight against the Tauros and Monardi. Got our asses handed to us. In fact, we lasted like two turns. Was it not even? I think we lasted not even one turn. Oh man, we're gonna have a hard time fighting them. Anyway, before we do anything, we're gonna... Let's, let's enfeeble them. That seems like the better idea. Because then, um... We'll do some enfeeble, some debilitate. We'll do some... I do not have any guard. <laughs> Synergy. Um, we'll go for Hail Prism. No guard. Synergy. Oh crap, that's not good. I thought I did. Oh well, our resistance is high enough. We should be good. Oh, look at. Oh no, no effect. That's not good. Oh, but look at this. We're taking like nothing. And we've got like two healers. Oh, we're gonna. We're fine. Never mind. Oh th no, that's not doing anything now. Heat Flash. Oh my god, I forgot about Heat Flash. I love the move Heat Flash. And I, that is one of the reasons why I, al I always wanted... <laughs> that's, that's one of the reasons why I always tried over-leveling my guys. Just because I've always wanted to um, teach Heat Flash and use it. Just because it looks so cool. Um, Alright, so what I used was uh, Curse, which I'll actually ensure that they'll die after a time. I, it might hit, I'm not sure. Um, I 
Oh no. Did I go for the wrong classes? Because I usually have a strategy for how to beat them. I might have gone. I might have needed to do some a couple of the double classes. Well, that's too bad. <laughs> yeah, because nobody has cutting edge. Oh, it's usually cutting edge I want. Oh well, we're gonna have to just go for it, I guess. Well, that's a bit um. That is a bit too bad. But, you know what, let's just go for it. It's too late now. <laughs> Whoops. Oh well. It's not that big of a deal. Let's go for, uh... Yeah, go for that. Go for, uh, yeah, you know, you uh... No, let's go for Wild Growth, how about? That's gonna do much more damage. And... We're gonna go for... I think a wish well. Yeah, we're gonna need a wish well at this point. And keep going for those hail prisms, Mia. Um, we'll probably use a summon after a while if we need to, but for now we're gonna just keep it with what we have. Because, I mean, they're not doing terribly much damage to us, and we're doing well enough damage against them, so... Once we get one of them down, we'll we'll be looking pretty well. So I'm just gonna focus on Saturos for right now, since he seems to be doing more damage than the Nardi. Um, shoot. Plus, I mean, come on, we already we already beat that fool. We gotta we gotta take him down, take him down notch. Excuse me. All right. So yeah, right at this point, it's just making sure that. Uh, making sure that I am well enough defended that if they pull any sort of card out of their sleeve, any sort of um, something that I'm not expecting, I'll be able to deal with it. It's pretty much you're using Heat Flash and other stuff. It's not terrible at any at any rate. Like, look, we're fully healed right now. I mean, we're a little low on Synergy, but that's no big deal. You know, they use Impact, no big deal. I mean, come on, you guys gonna throw something at me or... Okay, Inferno. That's throwing fireballs at me. That's that's cool. <laughs> um, actually, what does... Oh, that brings us down to a Shaman or an Enchanter. Okay, that's not something we want to do. I just wanted to check really quick. Um, Alright, so we're gonna keep going then. Actually, you know what? We could probably just... Let's try for just attacking for a second. See if that does any better. It might, actually. Actually, yeah, we're doing about the same with our synergy as we will with the attack, so I'm gonna attack for a little bit. Oh, come on, you guys had to use the defense <laughs> boost. Oh, that means we gotta go back to using synergy. Oh, well, that's too bad. Um... I'm gonna try debil debilitating them again. Might work. Also, come on, listen to this music. Not as cool as Deadbeard's music by any means. It's too bad, too. This Deadbeard's music is so cool, they should have just reused it. Oh well, it's not too big a deal. Ah, oh, that didn't work. Shoot. Alright, we gotta get through another healing spell. So let's keep going. Keep going with that. Wish well, Mia. You're the fastest right now. Wow, you're the fastest right now. That's impressive. <laughs> okay, we're, we're doing well. We're doing well. It is not over yet, by any means. Well, I mean, we no, no, <laughs> neither side's really taken any damage. No major damage, at least. But, um... On the same hand, we've been whittling it. We're whittling him down, so no, no big deal. No big deal. Boost those resistances again. Those were helping out quite a bit. Go for another wild growth. Um, yeah, why don't you do the wish well this time, Ivan? Mia, you go for the hail prism. Hopefully their defense returns to normal soon. Hopefully Satoros or Minardi goes down soon. 
Well, we gotta be careful, because they will eventually whittle us down. No, but we're doing good. We're doing good still. There we go. Yeah. How do you guys like it? Maybe we're fighting true Mars Masters, but now you're fighting true, uh... Everything else, masters. Ah, oh, Soteros, how are you still alive? You've got to be close. You've got to be close to going down. Uh, I'm going to use a regular wish, but I still need to use a wish. I want to keep that HP high. Oh, come on, Soteros. Jeez. I mean, once we take one of them down. We can just focus all our attack on the other one, so that's why I'm that's why I'm doing it. But man, it's taking a while. There we go. There's Soteros. Oh, it took you long enough. Alright, let's get uh Psy Crystal on Garrett, because he's kinda low. You have a Psy Crystal as well. No you don't. That's too bad. You can just attack then, Ivan. But, Mia, you do have a Psy Crystal, you use that one. Let's get our Synergy back up. You know, in the end, this is kind of an anticlimactic uh, boss battle. I mean, I, I know I said that uh, Deadbeard was a lot harder, but I mean, compared to this, I mean, anybody would be a lot harder. Jeez, this is... Nothing. This is nothing. We're just wailing on him. What the heck is this? Oh man, Supernova. I love that move too. <laughs> I've always wanted to uh, find out if there was a way to get that move for anybody, but I've, I've not been able to find it, so I'm assuming there's not. Death Size? Ooh, that's not good. Alright, let's see what we can... Oh no, I think we're good. Ooh, we'll be good. Just keep wailing on her. Oh, I was expecting a much harder fight from you guys, though. Come on. Well, I guess that's it, guys. I guess... Oh, good, everybody's leveling up. I guess that's the end of Golden Sun. Well, now, yeah, we, be we beat him. Well, yeah, kind of anticlimactic, though, so... Ugh. Yeah, Felix, what are you doing? I cannot give up Shiba. Well, that's 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 okay. Like, you can come with us. Yeah, we just saved you. I never asked you to help us. <laughs> I never asked for this. <laughs> yeah, come on, you're free to go, man. Spread your wings and fly away. <laughs> the four beacons must still be lit. Wait. You're going to light the beacons. That's ridiculous. Rid ridiculous. <laughs> I felt you'd say that in my circuits. <laughs> but I'm going to do it anyway. Does not compute. So wait, if he means to light the beacons, then he's our enemy, right? Yes, he is. Do what you will, Isaac. But if you try to stop me, I will fight you. I'll fight you too. I, I I hope you don't think you finished us off. Huh. Yes, I do. You can barely stand. It's like Mercury Lighthouse all over again. What, do you expect Alex to come in and save your, your behind again? You may not be finished, but you can barely st you can barely stand. Right, right, now, yes. But we'll be back on our feet as soon as we do this! Wait, what? <gasps> oh, no. <laughs> oh no! He threw the elemental star into the lighthouses! Light, er, the lighthouse. H how could this happen? We couldn't keep them from lighting the beacon! Why did they put a cage or something around it? That's not all. The energy of the beacon will restore our power. Wait, but, um... Yeah, Venus is an earth elemental, dude. Yeah, how would Venus give power to fire adepts? Oh my god. Well, we're about to find out, aren't we?